In this video, I'm going to tell you the divine traits, minor traits, blessings, everything needed to play Zeus, as well as some tips that are going to come in the end of the video. So stay tuned. The first thing I'm going to touch on is Zeus's divine trait. Out of all his divine traits, I use lightning storm. Why? Because it allows my heaven's rage to grant me a buff that allows my next bolt of Olympus or thunderstruck to have no cooldown. This basically allows me to double cast one of these abilities. I usually use bolt of Olympus. It makes more sense. Throwing out those lightning bolts twice guarantees most of the time if the player is not very experienced, you're going to get that knockout, especially if they're high on vulnerability. Now for minor traits. My first minor trait is going to be quick charge. It allows my Bolt of Olympus charge time to be reduced by 33%. This is super perfect if you want to get that quick cast off with the heavy knockback. So what you do need to understand with Zeus, if you allow your Bolt of Olympus to charge properly, it does more damage and it knocks back further. So coupled with Lightning Storm as your divine trait, imagine those two extremely powerful and fast lightning bolts hitting your enemies. They probably don't have time to react. If you use the alt and trick combo properly, you will not have to worry about anything. You're guaranteed to land at least one of your lightning bolts when you're facing an opponent. Now out of all your minor traits, this one in my opinion is the most important on Zeus. This minor trait is called Ungrounded, allowing you to hit an enemy who is in the air dealing an additional 10% knockback. Because if you know how Zeus is, you can knock back enemies very early in the game and destroy them, giving you that early victory if you combo off properly. So having that extra 10% knockback is going to help you so much in the future. Now for my last minor trait, I'm going to go with Generator. Damaging an enemy with an ability grants an additional 1% ultimate charge. This is perfect as landing abilities with Zeus is extremely important as that is where most of your damage and knockouts come from. And getting your ult up fast enough also allows you to do this awesome combo with your ultimate into your dual cast lightning bolt, which can secure your knockout of your enemy most of the time. Now for your greater blessings, I'm going to give you three options to use with this specific Zeus build. My main one I use is Arthur's Insight. Why? Because dodging hits grant you an additional 6% ultimate charge, allowing me to get my ultimate up a little faster, but not too fast, because with Zeus, you're going to be dodging a lot, because again, you're like Saul. You're basically a mage. You don't want to be up close and personal all the time on your enemies. Another one you can go with is Thor's Landing. Damaging an enemy with your first ability reduces its cooldown by 4 seconds. And with Zeus, having your ability of Surge, which is your first mobility ability, is one of your main attack ones. You have a double shot on it, so a dual cast. And doing damage on them allows you to knock back enemies very fast if they're out on the map, or allows you to do a nice combo where you go into them with your Surge, do a nice air light into air heavy, or just the air heavy, knocking them back. And the last greater blessing you can use is Saul's Temper. But as I've said many times before, Saul's Temper is good with every single character in the game. Now we're going to cover the lesser blessings. There are going to be a couple choices here you can choose from. The first one I'm going to use is Sharp Eyed. Projectiles that damage an enemy reduces the cooldowns of all abilities by one second. And since I'm building around Bolt of Olympus, being able to use that a lot reduces the cooldowns of all my abilities a lot faster, so it works out in my favor. Now the next lesser blessing is going to be Sudden Gust. Hitting an enemy while you are in the air deals an additional 10% knockback. And with Zeus, all I gotta do is jump and I can cast my bolt while I'm in the air. So it's perfect. And all this couples with all the other abilities to allow you to knock out enemies early and using that magnificent bolt of Olympus. Another lesser blessing you can use is Air Supremacy. After being airborne for 4 seconds, deal an additional 2 damage on hit up to a maximum of 4 damage per attack. This buff is removed when you land. Now for my opinion, Zeus is one of the characters that this is perfect for because you can literally control yourself in the sky most of the time. You are the sky father, am I right? Now two other honorable mention lesser blessings for Zeus is recklessness and sharp insight. Me personally, I don't use them, but they can be used. It was one of the earlier ones I tested out and it seemed to work fine when I was playing Zeus. Now that that's all covered, I'm going to give you guys in this portion of the video some tips that are going to help you become the best Zeus player you could possibly be. The first tip is to understand that Zeus is not a brawler, he is a mage. You need to keep your distance and when you're going in, know you can counter properly. Why I say that is because unlike other characters like Susana or Amaterasu or even Sun Wukong where you try to stay as close as possible, with Zeus it's all about kiting, it's just like Saul. Also be aware that you are able to counter a lot of abilities with your Bolt of Olympus and Thunderstrucks. It helps so much, so be very aware when you're using it as it's easy to miss but when you land it, it's very punishing on the enemy. For your next tip, note that Zeus's Thunderclap, or Booty Clap as I like to call it, which is his air heavy, is super powerful. It allows you to knock people back constantly, and if you get them at the right vulnerability, it's an easy GG. The last tip I'm going to tell you here is one of the most powerful combos on Zeus, and it all comes down to how well you learn how to use your Surge. So, for the first way to use this combo is if somebody is right off the map, you can use your Surge at the right timing to go straight in on them, it will stagger them for a bit, allowing you to either use an air light into air heavy, or just using an air heavy and most of the time that knocks them straight out of the arena. Now you can do the same combo easily when you are on ground and if you do land it properly you will knock them back and if you couple it with a bolt of Olympus if they are at a high enough vulnerability that's a guaranteed GG and if it does not knock them out you will still be able to knock them back enough to buy you some time to regenerate your cooldowns and gather yourself 
or you can edge guard them from there on and give yourself the victory. And this was just a quick overview build of what I do to play Zeus. Now, obviously, there's a lot more things you can do. And that's why I try to make videos of me playing Zeus. So I can give you guys an idea of how to play them and the massive combos you can use to destroy your opponents.